There's a new civic group that's turning its attention to North Baton Rouge. Baton Rouge Choice will target Ardenwood Village, Smiley Heights, and Melrose East. With a $500,000 federal grant and Mayor Kip Holden's help, members will fix up the housing, clean up the neighborhood, and address the crime issue. The ideal of revitalization is not just brick and mortar, but it's actually making sure that services and education and safety, all of those elements are built into revitalization. There are similar well-intentioned groups around the city, but Be Our Choice is all about giving a voice to those in the community. They gave us the opportunity to go around along with the mayor's office and find out what these people need. All three communities need help but are facing different issues. Ardenwood Village is full of children, many with single parents struggling financially. Smiley Heights has many senior citizens who have watched their neighborhood deteriorate over the years. Miss Evelyn been, in, um, been back there 52 years. She shouldn't have to walk out in front of her house and look across the street and see an old field with needles, dope, syringes, and all of that. That shouldn't be in our community. Researchers at LSU got feedback from over 100 people in the targeted communities. Neighbors who have stepped forward, who are very genuine, very compassionate, uh, those who um, initially didn't feel like they had a voice, and we have seen them grow, we've seen uh, them their capacity built, and we now see champions. Kids practice what they see. And once they see their parents involved and positive things happen, it's automatically going to flow on down here. In Baton Rouge, I'm Jason Dumas, NBC 33 News.